This is Austin Duma, Application Specialist at CAD Microsolutions, and today's tech tip describes how to use SOLIDWORKS to compare changes between files. Many people are unaware that SOLIDWORKS has a function that allows a designer to compare changes between two SOLIDWORKS files. The compare function has the ability to show differences between features, geometry, document properties, and annotations found in part and drawing files. Further to this, the Compare tool has been integrated with SOLIDWORKS PDM Professional so that a comparison can be done between two versions of the same file. Let's start the demonstration using two files saved outside of a PDM vault. On the screen we see a simple part file and I want to compare it with an older version of the same file that was saved with a different name. To access the Compare tool, I go to the Tools menu, select Compare, and then select the type of compare I want to do. In this case, I'm going to select features. The compare tool then appears in the task pane to the right. Note that in this window, I could choose to also analyze document properties and geometry from this window. This means that even though I only chose features from the menu when I first opened the compare tool, I can select the other options later. Now, with the open document being the newer file, I'm going to select it from the modified document pulldown. All open files in SOLIDWORKS will show up in this pulldown. In the reference document pulldown, I'm going to browse for the file that I want to compare against. In this case, flange underscore R1. And then once selected, click Run Comparison. SOLIDWORKS then analyzes the two files and presents them in separate windows with the modified file being at the bottom and the referenced or older file being at the top. Colors have been added to represent the changes. Yellow indicates changes to existing features that have been modified between the two files, and red indicates features that have been added or removed. Note how the red highlighted features appear in the two different windows. Because the red appears in the lower or modified document window, in this case flange underscore R3, this indicates new features that were added. Red highlighted features appearing in the top window indicate features that have been removed. If you look at the Compare Tool window in the task pane, it also indicates any added or removed features with a red dot. Note that my navigation tools are synced between the two windows. This means that I can look at the changes more thoroughly without having to navigate the two windows independently. Finally, I can save a comparison report using the Save button at the top. And to close the Compare Tool window, I simply click the little red X at the upper right hand corner. This closes the compare tool, but leaves the two files open. Let's perform the same exercise as before, but with a file being managed inside the PDM vault. On the screen, I have the same file with the compare tool already open, but you will notice that R3 is not in the file name. That is because PDM manages different versions of the file for us, so we don't have to save different versions of the file with different names. In the compare tool, I'm going to select the file shown on the screen, which is the latest version, from the reference document pulldown. In the previous example, I selected the latest file from the modified document pulldown, which I'm going to leave blank this time around. Instead, I'm going to select Document Properties checkbox. Within this option, I have another checkbox called Within SOLIDWORKS PDM Vault. I'm going to check this box as well. What then appears is two new pulldowns that allow me to select the versions of the file that I have opened and that I want to compare. Note that I don't have to compare an older version with the latest version. If desired, I can select any two versions to compare. In addition to this, I can see comments that were entered against each of the files each time it was checked in. This is one of the many reasons why comments in PDM are very important, as I can see a brief explanation of the history of the file without having to run this tool and physically go look at the older versions. For the purposes of this exercise, I'm going to select the latest version, version 6, and then compare it with the original version or version 1 and then select Run Comparison again. As with the files residing outside of the PDM vault, SOLIDWORKS presents the two versions in separate windows. But this time, the information shown in the Compare window is different. This is because I also chose to compare document properties. In this window, I can see general changes to the part file, such as mass, face, feature counts, and coordinate changes, but I can also see changes to custom properties. This appears in the File Properties section. In this particular example, I can see that the description for the file changed and that a new custom property was added. But where did my color highlights showing the feature changes go? 
To view these, I have to click the little Features tab at the top of the Compare window. I click this tab, and now I can see the same feature changes that I saw in my first example. Note that had I chosen to compare Document Properties, Features, and Geometry, I would see three tabs instead of two. And finally, as before, I can click the Save button to get a summary, or simply click the little red X to close the Compare Tool window. When closing the Compare tool this time, the two comparison windows close, but the original window showing the open file remains open, but minimized in the corner. I hope this has been an informative tech tip on how to compare files using SOLIDWORKS and how to compare versions of the same file that reside in a PDM vault. Have a great designing day.